You know my next guest. From her modeling days, as well as such films as Bulletproof Monk and Pearl Harbor, starting April 1st, she can be seen in the new movie Sin City. Please welcome the beautiful Jamie King. <laughs> Thanks so much for being here. I'm happy to be here. Um, you know, I, I have a question for you because you've worked for years in the in the world of fashion, and I just I don't know anything clearly about fashion, uh, and I'm curious about the low cut jean thing. So am I. Is that the low cut jean? I don't know if anyone else has noticed it, but for women started wearing it, and it was amazing. I was a big fan. Well, for guys it is. You no, know? But now for guys women, are wearing. Trying to be sexy, and you're flirting with a guy, and you're leaning over, and all of a sudden you realize that your butt crack is hanging out with your thong. It's like no, that's double thumbs up move. on that. That's fine. <laughs> There's no problem with that. It's the guys now are wearing the low cut stuff, and that's not good. No, guys should be wearing it. It's not flattering to the male physique. No. You disagree I mean, with me? Well, you know, if you're going for like the OG look, if you're wearing your boxers and purposefully wearing them the, like down to your knees, that's one thing. But like. But that's gangster, that's right? That's like gangster. That's Those gangster. Those guys can get away with it. You know, I can't believe, cool. like, yeah, they can make anything cool. If, if someone had said to me that having jeans, like, around your knees with your boxers showing would be the coolest thing you could do, but I guess that's the style, right? <laughs> I guess it is. I can't do it. So you think it's here to stay, the low-cut jean thing? I, I hope not. I hope not. Because I don't really like it. Because you put the pants on and all of a sudden it's like, wait, where's the rest of the jeans? That's the best part on the ladies. <laughs> um, <laughs> but anyway, that's just my babbling. Sorry, I got so excited there. Uh, I know you can't help it. Yeah, I can't help it. Uh, let's talk about Sin City, this movie. You are with some uh, other beautiful ladies in this film. Rosario Dawson Jessica is in this movie. Alba. Jessica Alba and you. This is this is. Uh, well, I think we have a photo here of the three of you uh, looking very beautiful together. What what event is this? This was at the Comic Con event. Did you say Con Con? Comic Con. Oh, I was hoping that's the Conan show. You know, like fan club. Uh, <laughs> Uh, what, uh, what, what is it? Comic Con is a comic book convention. It's a comic book convention, and like all the hardcore, avid comic book fans come to check out like all the new comic book movies and comic books, and it's crazy. I mean, you've got like all the Trekkies there, and all the people like dressed up in their crazy costumes. And they like, must have, they see three women like you coming to the comic book convention. It's pretty they're, crazy, you know. Their pocket Great protectors must have exploded. Yeah. I know, I know. They're like, oh my god. Mm, females. But after they were, they're, Yeah, yeah, wow, you must have blown their minds, incredible, wow. It was pretty cool, it's, yeah. it's a crazy experience. You right, know? and this was, you did this because the, 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 the movie Sin City has a comic book origin, is that right? Well, it's, Sin City is, basically, it's a movie brought to life based upon a graphic novel, which is the comic book by Frank Miller. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it's like the coolest looking and feeling thing that you've ever seen. It's all in black and white, except there's like splashes of color. Right. And Jessica Alba and Rosario Dawson and I were wearing like, I mean, God bless Rosario, because she's hardly wearing anything. She's wearing, like, little chains. Right, You know, right, a lot of Sin right. City is, like, these crazy characters, like, corrupt cops and, like, run by prostitutes. But the prostitutes with, like, a heart of gold, you know, so it's... Hook her with a heart of gold. Hook her it? with a heart of gold. <laughs> yeah, in Hollywood. They're always <laughs> yeah. such kindly ladies. Uh, <laughs> in real life, so cruel. <laughs> anyway, uh... Moving on. <laughs> So, uh, so you work together in this film, and, and it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, it sounds like uh, you aren't wearing much in this movie. No, you know, I think I'm actually wearing the most out of all the characters, but, I mean, Jessica's wearing, like, chaps. Right. And she's, like, does, you know, dances on the bar with a lasso. Okay, and, I I'm going to see the film, yeah. Yeah, you know, that's reason enough. I mean, guys love it. April yeah. 1st, I'm going to plug this, like, nine <laughs> times. Uh, I keep noticing while we're talking, you have a tattoo on your wrist. Tattoos? Have... Yeah, I thought it was a good idea when I was, like, 16. What are they? What? A spade and a diamond. I, they don't mean anything. I thought it would be cool. I, I wish I would have done something like maybe like dyed my hair blue right. or red. You know, I mean, something that you could you change. You like the red look? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I like that look. I'm stuck with the red. For, yeah. <laughs> but you like the, uh, I mean, so you got those. How old were you when you got those? I think I was like 16. Don't you regret those tattoos you get and then I later do. on? I do. I have those and I have some fairies because I really like fairies and angels a lot. Pardon but me, I mean, let's back up just a second. You have fairies yeah. on, tattooed on your body somewhere? Mm -hmm. What kind of fairies are we talking about? 
like really pretty angelic ones. Right. I like anything that's really mystical and magical, like Lord of the Rings and Harry Potter. And if the nerds had heard this at Comic Con, <laughs> I know. What kind I of tattoos do you have? Of yeah. yeah, you could have flashed them, and Gandalf is right here. No! <laughs> Gandalf the Grey. Wow. Well, Sin City opens. On April, April 1st. 1st. Who am I to mock nerds? It's so crazy. <laughs> Sin City. Oh, I'm a jock, yeah. <laughs> Opens on uh, April 1st. Jimmy King, it's always great having you here. Thanks so much for Thank being here. So yeah, much. good luck to you, Jimmy King. Your hands are cold. <laughs> we'll take a break. Regina Spector when we come back.